Fire Talk Time. I'm Tara. And I'm Brim. So today we'll be doing a Wings of Love pad review. So as I've mentioned before, my pad definitely has a story to it. Um, and I will tell you that in a moment. And this is what our pads look like. The owner is very, very nice. Um, I can't remember her name. It starts with an M. Yeah, Marin Marin. Myron? I don't I think it's Marin. Um, but I don't know if it's Marin. I'm sorry. Um but it looks really pretty. <laughs> uh, so she was so sweet to deal with. Um, so the first thing I did, I, I contacted her and said, would you be willing to send us a pad to review? And then a few minutes later, I was looking at her store, seeing what I liked. So she said yes, I could like say if I like something or not. And um, I saw this print in a 9-inch moderate. And I just sent her a combo saying, could you make that a 7-inch? Because most of her pads are made to order, so... You can change things, kind of like pink lemonade shop. Um, some of them are like made to order, and then she'll definitely tell you if like this pad is ready to ship. And she said, yeah, yeah, and then she got back to my other combo about the sands and stuff. I saw that you just wanted the 7-inch moderate pad. So uh, she made us that, and then she also made us one for actual sample and review. Mm -hmm. Can't really see it very well. It's just kind of glare. It's a little like rainbow snake. It was really cute. Yeah. So I didn't realize it's actually... I thought we were just paying for, like, shipping and, like, the fee of the pads, but really, I purchased this pad, and this pad is free. I thought it was a combination of them both, so I just realized that that's just, that kind of just clicked for me, like, a week ago or so, but my pad is popped and hot, and it's called the Enchanted Kingdom print, and it's absolutely gorgeous. This one's just, I don't know what it's called. Rainbow Fiance. Oh, Rainbow Fiance. I know, I just, I don't know. We'll call it, <laughs> that's what I always call it. Yeah. This blue anti-pilfies back. And, and mine has black and white broken like peachy, They're more peachy than the video. Yeah, it's kind of like a peachy orange. Mm -hmm. So as you can see, her pads are the wrap wing style. Mm -hmm. So they really um, give you great wing protection, which is not something that I need. Um, but for people who do need it, it is great. Mm -hmm. So I love the print. Uh, so now let me tell you the story. So um, my naturopath, She's really nice. She specializes in women, women's health. So I brought her a menstrual cup to show her, and I thought I'd bring her a cloth pad to show her. And I brought a few, because I thought if she was really interested in them, I would show her, like, different sizes. And I, I just had gotten this one, so I wanted to bring this one, because it's so impressive. This is the one I bring around when I want to show you about cloth, because it is so beautiful. Everyone's like, wow, that is so pretty, because who doesn't want that in their pants? Like, that's so pretty. Um... So I showed it to her, and she's like, wow, that is so cool. And I told her I made them, actually, and she said she would sell them through her shop, and I'll make a video about that later today. Um, anyways, but that doesn't matter. <laughs> anyways, so my appointment was done, and then I was just sitting there and in the waiting room area, and my mom was in her her uh, appointment. And I'm sitting there looking at a magazine, and I get up the pad, like this one, to just look at for a minute or two because it's so pretty. And then I fold it back up, like with the black fleece showing. And I just, like, popped back in my bag, bag, you know, I kept reading a magazine. It was actually a really disturbing magazine. It was, like, about animals and, like, how poorly they're treated. And ever since I read that, I can't eat meat. Like, I can, but it's just, I don't, and, like, sometimes I'm just, I don't like, reach I'm for it. I'm vegetarian for a week on end. Yeah, but those are animals that aren't really treated well. We eat, yeah. Yeah, we, we order our meat online and it's shipped to us from a, a farm in the... Northwest, I can't remember where it's from, um, called Tendergrass Farms. Anyways, and, you know, it's fine. That doesn't matter. <laughs> so we left, and we were going to shop. We were shopping, you know, and we went to Chipotle, and blah, blah, blah. And then we stopped at, uh, what's it called, like the World Trade. Um, oh, the 10,000 Villages? Yeah, 10,000 Villages. Um, I think it's called Fair Trade because they got some kind of chocolate um, so, we were, the woman there, we were looking for a basket so that my doctor's office could put the pads in, which we're going to get and just show them, well, well, no, it doesn't matter. We can show it, them in the other video. Yeah, we'll show them in the video. <laughs> um, so, we picked out a basket, and she's like, oh, what's it for? And I go to my purse to show her this pad. I couldn't find it, I'm like, oh, whatever, and it's somewhere down there. I'm, like, oh, I'm a little worried, because I'm like, I can't find it. So, I, I didn't want to, like, I just pretend I pulled out this one, I don't know what I pulled out. I pulled out another pad. I showed her, she was 
probably had already gone through menopause. She didn't care at all. <laughs> um, she's just like, okay, whatever. Yeah, right. it's weird. <laughs> she didn't care. Anyways, and I'm just, my mom's like, where is it? I'm like, I don't know. So we get out of the store and we're like frantically searching for it. I'm like, oh no. So we like trace our steps back. We go in Chipotle. We go back into like the little gift shops we've been in. I'm like, well, it could be in the doctor's office. So we go back to the doctor's office and I'm getting really worried because this tab is sent to us for review and I'm like, oh no, I can't lose this tab. Like, oh no, what am I going to do? So when we look at the doctor's office, the doctor's out and it's a new receptionist. So I'm like, oh no. So we're like, what are you looking for? I'm like, I'm looking for a cloth menstrual pad. I'm like, what? I'm like, well, you see, it's green. It has castles on it and it has black on the back and has gold snaps. They're like, I'm like, well, maybe they found it, so they're looking in the office and everywhere, and so I just happen to, like, go back, like, we're just about to give up, and I just glance into the, um, waiting room, and there's on the floor in the corner, like, all folded up, and it was all black, you know, behind, like, a, a chair, and I, I had, like, thrown it in my bag and missed, and I found it, I was just like, oh, no, I was so happy to find it, but it was definitely an adventure, so now I've learned, don't take a pad out of the house until you've handled it and you it, <laughs> so yeah. That's a story to my pet. I don't think Brent's pet has a story. But I was getting really worried. So, you know, this has been a bonding experience. So, I like this pet. I really do, actually. I've got to say it's not my favorite because I'm just not a really fan of the wrap wing style. But, you know, it's it's the most wrap, most comfortable wrap wing style that I have. Yeah, that is really comfortable. It's kind of like Mimi's Dreams, you know, the, like, Yeah, a little. Wing. It's a little more comfortable. I mean, I just have, like, a big Mimi's Dream, so maybe a small one. Mm-hmm. But her sewing is fabulous. Yeah. And it's funny. Um, one side comes over more. It's the same on her pad as well. So I think it's her pattern. It just cut. You can see. Yeah, like this one. Like this one. And there's a thing. You can see, though. <laughs> Probably can't really. But it, it is like yeah, one comes over more. Yeah. One comes over more. So maybe she just needs to alter her pattern a little bit. It's not a problem. It doesn't make it uncomfortable or anything like that. So it's it's very narrow. It's about two point two five inches wide, and I love that. They have absorb in them. Um, for some reason, this pad is thicker. They're both the same absorbency, but the micro fleece is somehow thicker. I don't know how. Unless there's like a light to moderate. Mine's like a moderate. I don't I mean, understand. I think they both have one layer. But... As you can tell, one of them, the top one is thicker. So I don't know. I don't care. It doesn't matter to me. Anyways, so I had no staining with this. It was a beautiful fabric and no problems. Yeah, even though this one was white, it didn't stain at all. Mm -hmm. So her prices are very, very affordable. She has gorgeous prints. Um, they're just beautiful. And her customer service is amazing. She got back to me so quickly. It was really late in the evening when I contacted her. She finished the pads that night and shipped them off early in the morning. And they came in like two days. It was amazing. And she sent us dum dums with our oh, yeah. order. <laughs> so I would recommend Wings of Love pads. They're beautiful. Um, if you need like wing protection, these would be great because they like they really the cover you. <laughs> See, the only reason I don't like them is because when they curve your underwear, they do get a little like bunchy slightly. Yeah. Um, but that's just me. That happens to me. But a lot of people love the wrapping style, and that's great. Um, I just prefer tabs. It's just my personal opinion. So if you need, um, actually, I think it's her liners are a lot wider than her, like, actual pads, which is interesting. So I don't know about that, but that's kind of cool. So they get to be kind of, like, floppy and more comfortable. And then when her pads get bigger, they're not wrap wing styles anymore, really. They have, like, this kind of wing, but it's more tab. So I'd really be interested to try, like, a liner and have a pattern here and review that because um, they're so different, and I really... Maybe we'd like to try that. Maybe I'll purchase something from her. So, yeah, her sewing is amazing. The pad is really comfortable. Um, this is going to be my display pad. I really am going to show this off to friends. They're like, they really think this is impressive. Let's think about yours. It's, it's pretty comfortable. It's not my favorite, but it doesn't bunch up too much. And it's a great travel pad, actually. Yeah, it, it snaps up really nicely. It is something I'll put in my purse and carry with me mm -hmm. for showing off and also for traveling because it's not bulky so if I'm whatever I'm wearing it doesn't like show through my pants or anything yeah. like that but look it's like the perfect little package so I love it for that reason like the best ever. Mm -hmm. definitely mm -hmm. so if you're a traveler these may be something you want to look into and then super easy to snap up like the soiled holes as well mm -hmm. 
Because I know a lot of pads don't actually even snap up. Yeah. So, very, very nice. I believe she only uses flannel and cotton as top fabric. Um, I don't think she has anything else, but maybe she will in the future. So I would definitely recommend you check out Wings of Love pads. They're really nicely made, nicely sewn. They're perfect. They're just amazing, and I love mine to pieces. It's something I'll wear, like, when I want to feel like a princess. <laughs> so thanks for watching. Please subscribe. I'll leave the link to her shop down below, and I hope you check her out and make a purchase from her.